All right, so we're gonna talk a little bit about Von Flu Chokes, which is one of the requests. Um, I would say the guy that I've gotten to train with that has the best Von Flu Choke I've ever seen is Seth Champ up at Triangle Jiu Jitsu in Durham. He has an incredible Von Flu. And as somebody who likes to go for guillotines a lot, he really makes me wary of how I'm doing it because I know he's gonna try to go for that Von Flu. Um, before we get into it, that's the reason I use the arm in guillotine so much, or at least one of the reasons is when I'm using the arm in variations, it denies my opponent a chance to ever go for the Von Flu. So if Ian shoots an arm in guillotine, and then I jump to this side like everybody wants to do, this arm isn't free, so my shoulder can never find Ian's neck, so I can never get the choke. That said, the Von Flu is gonna show up when that arm is free. So same situation, Ian shoots a no arm in guillotine. I hop to the side and I'm already up on Ian's shoulder. I can do that as I'm passing or I can do that once I'm down here in the choke. I reach nice and deep and find the lap and then I pull Ian towards me. Now I always get up on my toes and then I just drive forward. When you do the Von Flu correctly, somebody who really likes to stay on the guillotine like a bulldog they're gonna have this moment where they're like, ah, I can still have faith in my choke. And then by the time it really starts to sink on, a lot of times they can't free themselves. I know Seth sometimes will even hold the hand in place so you can't escape. So I've always thought that was a really good system and he's definitely von fooled me before with that. So same thing, as the guillotine happens, we're passing. This time I didn't grab the shoulder right away so I need to find it after the fact. If I just drive in, that's okay, but it's even better if I pull him towards me. Now, as I add pressure, I get the tap. And you can see here, I'm controlling this wrist so it can't leave, so he can't frame me away. So that's a little bit on the Von Flu choke. It's always something to be aware of, you know, and it's something that we have to address. So that's why, especially with people who are good at passing while I have the head trapped, I try to stay arm in to take away that option, but it's something you have to keep in mind. So check it out, play around with it, enjoy it.